The civil societies a few weeks ago protested against the astronomical hike in Smet and gave the government two weeks to intervene. With the expiration of the two weeks, members of the group gathered again to review their stand during a press conference where it was agreed by them that 48 hours ultimatum to be given to the federal government and state to act of festive approach. Spokespersons for the various groups said they cannot fold their hands and watch the people being tormented because of increase in cement and other building materials. They said a smart piece of the people, they have no other choice than to cry out for the oppressed in the society. If we allow this 4,000 increment of cement to stand, that means that in a short possible time, a common man can no longer dream of holding a house again in Nigeria. If it's an increase in cement product and we are saying enough is enough, now, we are using this media to call on Edo State government and federal government that if, we ref if they refuse to attend to this issue in the next 48 hours, we are going to call for nationwide protests. Isoleto Africa! The high cost of living and the low standard of living. Cement was increased, such as water was increased to 20 naira. Road was also increased. Our life, they say, begin to end. They will become silent about things that matter. We are very peaceful people. That is why we gave them another 48 hours to address the issues we raised. Call those that are in charge of this cement, in charge of every other thing, to tell them that you people said to us, don't have the money that the leaders, those government people have to buy. We suffer for our money. The 48 automatons have been given to the various people office to do their various duties. Otherwise, we fall back to the streets and barricade all roads. Members of the coalition express optimism that the government will act fast to avoid a shutdown. A full one were reporting.